But I can also safe swap Galv, and I'm pretty comfortable safe swapping Galv, so. Something like that. Yeah, let's do it. I'm not going to think about it. N brain off. Buzz wool on. Let's fucking go. Buzz. 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 Let's buzz. Night. Send help. <laughs> Send help. Uh, yeah, I'm like, it's Dragon Claw. It's Dragon Claw. I'm not Shield and Dragon Claws. Okay. Verizian. Well, the good news is we baited out the Verizian, I guess. The bad news is they have a Verizian, I guess. And they still have a Charizard we have to contend with. This is it. This is a Sacred Sword, which I resist. I mean, we're not going to win this fight, frankly. But what I can do is I can lunge them so hard that I don't have to worry about a neutral non-stab Sacred Sword. Also, if they, they have to throw another move at me or uh, they're going to die. Yeah. So we can just farm them. The downside is that... Uh, the Buzzwool does not really threaten the Charizard anyway. So, we're going to have to hope for the best. Yeah, that's definitely not it. Nope. It's a Tentacruel. So, that's terrible. That's downright awful for us. So our Buzzwool has nowhere to go. Buzzwool is just absolutely not going anywhere. They also shielded, which kind of sucks. Right? We just have not... We can literally do nothing with our Buzzwool. I was not expecting this to come in. I was really expecting the Charizard to come in. But I guess both of these things... Anyway, and we shielded the Scald. Gross. Yeah, I think we're done. Fine, I'm not I'm not even gonna shield this I think we've I think we've lost I think no matter what we do here the game is basically functionally over Buzzwool can't kill this and it definitely can't kill a Charizard so yeah you shielded that yeah we lose GG's we're just gonna concede that no chance Buzzwool might also just be bad y'all you know that right Buzzwool might just be absolutely not having targets <laughs> it's it's one of those Pokemon that I don't know is great on your team because its coverage is pretty poor. And uh, if you run into something like a Charizard, it just, you don't have any play. You don't have any play. Amastar. Well, we have play against Amastar. We also have play against Venusaur. And given the scenario, I think we just stay in against Venusaur. I think this is fine. Like even a even a sludge bomb here, like is it really a threatening move? And it's only gonna get worse for them over time, so pew pew. Okay. I don't really want to switch here. Uh but if they give me uh or something that's like really good. Ah, see, we definitely don't want to stay in against Charizard. Definitely don't want to stay in against Charizard. And I definitely want to preserve my shields because we're going to need to galve this thing. Yes, that's going to hurt, but like. Okay. Shield away, friend. Shield away. Yeah, we're not protecting this. 
Ancient power. Yeah, that's pretty strong. I'll give you one. Because our timer is going to be up and we're going to be able to superpower this thing, right? So it either dies or they use a shield. Either outcome is fine with me. Oh, actually, that is a little awkward for us. That is a little... Oh, boy, that did way more damage than I thought it was going to do. Way more damage than I thought it was going to do. That's not good. Ancient, I guess ancient power has been adjusted a little bit, hasn't it? Question now is, can I kill this thing? I think we can. Right? Yeah. Yeah. There's also some glass cannoning happening. I just, I guess what I mean to say is I can't outright tell you how much damage ancient power from an Amistar does to a Galvantula. And you know what? <laughs> Personally, I hope to never get to that point. I'd personally like to never know that. Aside from, like, ballpark. I know the ballpark now. But I don't ever want to know that outright. It's Snorlax Holmes. Good luck, friend. Amphros. Hey, it's like a neutral fight in the lead. That's fun. It's probably Thunder Punch. I, I think I can happily tank one Thunder Punch. And if it's Brutal Swing, then that's terrible. Yeah, it's more than that, JP, as, we, as we've come to find out. It is more than that. That's tasty. Nom, 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 nom. Uh, do we shield an Aqua Tail? Oh, it's a Crunch. Crunch hits a little harder. I still don't think we're shielding this matchup. I think we actually just chew them. We get we end up a little low, but... We end up a little low, but I should be able to get two moves here, I'm hoping. We're going to get two moves. Do we double lunge? I think the damage output... Actually, we might not... Come on. Give me... Okay, we do. The I realized Lick actually makes this pretty awkward. We got a shield on a lunge, too, which is great. We'll lunge again. And then Buzzwool comes in as just kind of like... Yeah, I don't really care what you got going on. We're just going to keep lunging. Although, I guess I still need a shield because... Like... This is fine. The question here is, okay, I'm going to do something greedy here. We're going to do something greedy here. There we go. Because I was pretty sure I could counter through, and then it gives me two superpowers, and then we just... We get to do the Buzzwool flex for the win. Unless they see impede me there. No, they didn't. Buzzwool flex for the win. They never even see our third Pokemon. I see princess. How's it going, friend? Rawr. Rawr. GG's. Hey, we're gonna make we're gonna make Buzzwool shine whether we whether we uh should or not. We're gonna try. We're gonna try and make Buzzwool look like an all-star. <laughs> we're gonna try. Ah, hopefully not. I hope not, Sea Princess. Everything that happens on Twitch is wholesome and good. Absolutely peak appropriate for work. Oh, a Zapdos? Zapdos is... This first one we've seen is definitely a bit of a nightmare for us. Ooh, into Swampert. Okay. Now, the question here is, I know in Great League, this is a matchup that you can steal. I don't know how stealable in Ultra League it is. 
It probably is a matchup we could steal. But it's probably not easy. Oh, boy. And by not easy, I mean I guarantee you it's not an easy matchup to steal. Come on. Ooh, okay. I mean, it cost us a shield. But we are going to come out of this with... Uh, obviously, we... like The problem is they're setting up their Zapdos for... Uh, oh, hey. A fellow human of character. Um, the Zapdos up a shield is a real problem for us. Right? Oh, that's that sucks. I don't think uh I don't think our boy here learns uh that move. I mean on Galv, I don't I actually don't think you want to be running energy ball anyway. I think you really want the lunge. Uh we're shielding this because it's gonna be a thunderbolt. And our wing condition here is very much Try and get both their shields and uh maybe Please don't CMP. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, that's bad. That's bad. Because I don't think I can counter through it. It's going to be close, but Drill Pack is just going to ruin Yeah. It, we needed a little more damage on it, but I don't know if it would have been enough. I guess if we didn't throw any. But then, they're, then their uh, Buzzwool has a bunch of energy and two shields to work with. And we needed, like... A combination of fast move pressure and to get rid of their shields. So so far, Buzzwool has not been the answer. Let's let's put it that way. Buzzwool has been uh has not been finding very many targets, and it's just so unbelievably dead against any flyers. Yo, it's Ali T. Good luck, Ali. Uh Oranguru. Oh baby, here's a here's a fight. I assume we lose this badly, right? Because we take a bunch of damage. Okay. But its charge move options are pretty bad against us, right? Foul play, yeah. Do we win the one shield against Oranguru? And counterpoint, do they yeah, okay, we're gonna we're gonna pivot now. I don't think I shield, it's double lunge debuffed. So I think we just tank this. Yeah, that's still correct. Ooh. A mill tank? Interesting. First one of these we've seen. And we just get the lunch ring going. I realize now that we're running basically a pile of Pokemon with lunge. Like, we're just straight up lunging. Straight up lunging. I guess what they can do here is like if this kills me or they th this actually probably won't kill me because you know they might have a body slam for the buzzwool I have no idea what to expect in the back but I think we I think we do bring in the buzzwool and just try and put some damage on this thing yeah and soak it and then we should be able to wall rind through it They'll switch here, right? There's no way this thing just stays. It's super debuffed, so like... Come on! Oh, got him. Alright, no Thunderbolt. What else you got? We got the Guru still. Let's make sure this dies before it gets to throw a move at me. Oh...
I believe two Icicle Spears is still correct. Because I think one Earthquake is like just awkwardly not enough. Although a lunge here is pretty bad for us. Now the question is, do I need to go to Earthquake? Can I get to Earthquake? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. We're just going to do it. Seems safe. Although if the Guru has a move, then you know what? Allie T, you, you did it. If you got a move, Allie. Poof. <laughs> Yeesh. GG's. Yowzas. Yowzas. Lots of normal. Lots of... Lots of spice. You love to see it. You love to see it. 